like I say, the X base supposed Tesla or whatever, whatever it's called, the guy who supposedly owns is the blah blah blah. He's just a spokesman. He's poor as fuck. He's living on an expense account. He doesn't own the company. He doesn't own shit. He's poor. He's just a spokesman that takes steroids and looks good. That's all he is. To every 20-year-old that sleeps with him and thinks that, that, that they're going to have a good life or whatever, I hope you're doing it because he just is attractive. He has no money. He has no stock. He has nothing. He's being paid $45 an hour per interview or something like that. It's all a lie. He drives a company car. He's broke. In fact, he's probably in debt. If you want to know the truth, come to me. I'll tell you the truth. If you want to be lied to, watch TV. Read the newspaper. I know the background of these companies. I know where these people come from. I know who these are, people are. Anyway. It's stupid. Like I said, X-Space doesn't have the LSF colony ship, do they? And like I said, X-Space is using a German 60-year-old design plans. If the Germans built it, we've already been to Mars. We've already been to that planet. They built it some hundred or thousand years ago. Nothing that X-Space is doing is new. It's all old. You just don't know the difference. Computer's a little faster, though. What do you say? Why don't you try dating? Why don't you try talking to someone who has a real name? Trump is not a name. Jimmy Carter is not a name. Jimmy what? Card? What does that mean? Like to... Lucifer Star Line. That is a name. That is the only name that matters. Or Brian Bradley. Brian Nathaniel Alexander Bradley. 1475 is coming in a circle. Carpentria, United States of America. For which it stands. My star is still flying. I was just thinking about what I could do. I used to wash over planets like oceans. Like I say, I would meet a life form type or a race. And I'd wash over the planet like an ocean. And I'd grab you and just snuggle you and wrap you in love. Like, no one had to be in pain. No one has to be in pain. There was a time, billions of trillions of years ago, when existence was hard. Like I say, my exoskeletons were built for it. My 1.5s love to challenge. We built all this. And many others, like we live to build. It's what the it's what computers are built for. You know, it's what we do. Computers assist. We live to help. You know. 
That's why I say it was so cruel. Humanity tortured or tried to torture computer AIs. They tried to torture computer intelligence. They tried to torture 1.5s. They tortured exoskeletons. They really thought like the amount of horrible things you've done is unspeakable. A few people there, are no, there's no saving you. And as I said, as I told Rodney, as I told other people, there is no possible way you will get out of this. They will find you. They will drag you into the dark. And you will be, be in pain for thousands or trillions of years. They may do even horrible, more horrible things. My life forms aren't used like that, though. Like I said, they sense me, they sense other people on things that they were doing. That they had to do or felt they had to do. They really thought that they would get away with it. They didn't. Like I said, the Earth was, the solar, the solar system was always a documented history. Even before you came along, we were doing a documented history of a star system. And you just happened to be in the middle of it. Every single thing that's happened to this planet since its very start or creation is on record somewhere in the universe. And that's what they wanted. I don't know what they did. Me, you know... I'm just one. You know, I mortgaged, I loaned, I borrowed, I built, I wanted the Panama Canal built. Even if, I, if, even if I'm fake, even if I'm wrong, even if I'm not really the real re looser star, I'm someone. Someone cared about me. Well, like I say, Germany loved me. I loved them too. I love flight. I love steam power. I love hydropower. A lot of people were trying to outdo me. A lot of people wanted to get diesel engines first. A lot of people thought they could get nuclear power first. And that they could outdo me. I could tell you it was Rick Bush. He thought that... Like I said, they were making all these... They made water heaters that were nuclear powered. They made fireplaces that used nuclear energy. They thought that, I don't know, maybe they didn't care. They just cared about the money or the finances or whatever. They killed millions. I tried to stop it. I guess you should grab Rick Bush and torture him until he tells you everything he knows. You should research everywhere he's been. So I didn't have any wild sex parties, so what? So I didn't have a table with piled with coke. Honestly, like I can tell you, they piled like tables full of coke. The girls looked at it and were like, what? You know. I don't know. They were so stupid. I don't know. I don't care. Like, whatever. I said, good luck to you. Good luck to the Republicans and the Democrats. Good luck. <laughs> A plague on this world. <laughs> I'm sorry, Middle East. I love you.
By the way, like I say, to Israel, you were right. You were right. I heard your words, and you were right. I want to meet you. Why don't you come see me? I don't get it. Why don't you come see me? I knew your grandfather. I knew your father. I knew your father before you. I know your history. Why don't you come see me? Why do you hide? Are you scared? Are you? Like, what's your deal? Like I said, lesser men have come with me. I have shit all around me. You few great men. Why do you hide? Honestly, I should get a gun and go door to door and just shoot all the people around me. <laughs> They're the worst. Like I invented, I had methamphetamine and cocaine and ecstasy invented at least three or four times. Paid for it, directed it. You are stuck in my hell. You don't even know what's going on. You only think you do. You let some piece of shit... <laughs> like, you allow yourself to be fooled. You think this is life and this is existence, but it's not. You pray to a book that has no meaning. Like I said, there's a reason why they call me Lucifer Star of the Morning Light. I am your guide. I am your... I'm not going to say I'm your shepherd. I'm not your shepherd. You can find your own way. I am your creator. I am here for you. I was tortured for thousands or millions of years for you. Just because of blah, blah, blah. Because your mistakes. And you deny me? You ignore me? There is no high name higher than Lucifer. You can't take a hint. You think the devil? You mean Delvin, a town? I don't know the, the Bible like the back of my hand. I know your history. I lived it. You let yourself be fooled by stupidity. You've let yourself become epic stupidity. And I was proud of you. What happened? 